what's going on all you funky party people in that world of youtube this is zach aka zeo fox here with another juice review from dreamscape vapors and today i am going to be reviewing pirate's cove now pirate's cove is a blend of lime lemon and coconut so makes sense why they call it pirate's cove um this is a six milligram nick level at a 50 50 pg vg mix there is no menthol in this and it's 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 a very nice vape so let's go ahead and load it up on the on the trident here real quick and i will give you my first thoughts and impressions well first off let me say this when you open up the uh the little bottle that it comes in and you take a nice big whiff of it you definitely get the lemon and lime scents off of it so it to me kind of smells like i have more or less opened up a can of sprite or a can of 7-Up, to in all in all honesty with you. So, I, I do like Sprite as a soda, so I'm hoping that the taste is quite, quite similar to that. So, now that I've got that loaded up, we will give it a, give it a test run. Well, as you can already see, the vapor production by it is is, is freaking fantastic, if, if I do say so myself. And that's not really drawing all that hard. Granted, I am running a dual coil at 0.8 ohms on the Trident at this moment in time. But the flavor is, oh my god, crystal clear. It... It is what it says online. It tastes like lemon, lime, and there's there is a hint of coconut in there. I will have to say, uh, but the coconut isn't overpowering for those that aren't necessarily into the coconut flavors and uh, coconut vapes. Uh, but you do get mainly the lemon and the lime. So that was a that's a big big plus for me um it does taste like i've opened up a can of sprite and started drinking it that's exactly how it tastes i'm not gonna lie uh and i i love it i absolutely love it um there will be others that may say it tastes like seven up and that's not too far off, but for me personally, it tastes more like Sprite than anything else. I'm going to take a, a bigger hit this time, and we'll see how much vapor we can actually produce. As you can see, it still produces a, a massive, massive cloud. And I'm not running anything special. This is just a Stingray with a Sony VTC4 and a Trident V2 with, like I said, a dual standard coil cotton wick at 0.8 ohms. And it's a clean absolutely 100 percent clean hit there is no burning in the back of your throat because of the nick level it's just phenomenal 
it, it it absolutely is. I would definitely recommend this for those that do tend to like soda flavors and without a doubt. This is absolutely by far one of the best vapes that I I have vaped. <laughs> Not gonna lie. No lies. Um so I will definitely be purchasing more of this from Graham over at Dreamscape Vapors who did a smash up job. Two thumbs up to him for Pirates Cove. Um link to his website will be in the description um so feel free to head over there and go pick yourself up some top-notch e-juice um all the e-juices that he makes or he has he has made himself so so it pretty much is what it says on the on the page if it says it's a uh a Belgian waffle with syrup flavor. I I don't know. Um, then that's pretty much what you're gonna get. You'll get the Belgian wa waffle flavor with that hint of syrup, more than likely. Um, but I know as far as Pirate Cove is concerned, it tastes like a Sprite. You do get that hint of coconut, but it's like I said, it's not overpowering. So I have to would have to give this a five out of five stars. So. I would say definitely, definitely go check them out. Um, like I said, a link to his website will be in the description. He has everything from mods to e-juices, uh, just about anything in between. So feel free to go over and check him out. Um, other than that, I am on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Links to those are in the description. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you on the other side of the interwebs. So, you guys keep on keeping on and vaping strong. Take it easy.